Okay, so the next step is quite literally finding somewhere to put all this. Um, managed to clear a bit away. I can get back over there. And I've turned these cupboards into paint storage, which is why this is over here at the moment. But in order to find somewhere for all that to go, i got to sort this out. This was my bedroom. Um, it's basically turned into a bit of a dumping ground recently. But the, the idea is this is going to become a storage room and a workshop. So the idea is that that wall over there has all these polytubs stacked up on a rack of some description. Uh, this wall here will become material storage. And then this wall here will become the workshop area with like stuff up on the wall. Um, I've already started clearing out. This door was literally jammed to there. So I've already started clearing stuff away. Getting A lot of it is junk. I've got to be fair. A lot of it is awful and just crap. And I've got to get rid of it all. Um, but anyway, there's a built-in chest of drawers under all that. So that's going to go. And then over here is a built-in set of wardrobes. This one's got quite some quite fun stuff in. And the one over there is just full of shit, unfortunately. The main worry is I've always had a damp issue in that corner. So I've bought some tools just in case I have to completely reskin that corner of the building. I, I might have issues in that corner. I don't know. So I've bought some tools. I might end up having to reskin most of the wall here. But the general idea is I'm going to start here, which is what I've done, and I'm working up that way, going as far as I can, because then I've got a spare bit of wall to start putting the stuff that's over here. So the idea is work dunk, 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 in terms of clearing, boxing, stuff like that. Then that means I can get at that corner, most of that wall, and then this whole cupboard section is going to come out completely. Um, which will then take the wall from here, the, the, the built the room from here to literally here. So it gives me another two and a half feet-ish. But I've just got to start the clearing process. I used to sleep in here. I slept in here for eight years and it's a shithole. But yeah, so I'm going to, like I say, starting over here, working that way. I've already started sorting through stuff. Uh, it's working out quite well. I had a stack of like eight plastic boxes here and I'm down to like four, three and a half, something like that. And I've just got to carry on that way for right now, getting rid of stuff, making the room that I need so that I can stack stuff against this one. Uh, this wall I'm pretty sure is okay. I'm not sure about in the corner, but this wall here is okay because it's an internal wall. So I'll be able to just stack stuff against that. Then once I've got it cleared enough, it's, you know, take care of the decoration, tear the floor out. I'm probably going to go with hardwood flooring simply because I've still got a ton of this stuff left. We ordered too much when we did the kitchen, so I did the bathroom and I've still got like six packets left, which would be more than enough to do this room. This room is maybe three meters square, if that, so... Yeah, and it'll also be a bit easier to tidy up because it is, as I say, going to be a workshop. Um, I do need to see, there's a floor vent in here somewhere. I guarantee you that's what's causing the damp. As I found in the rest of this house, is that floor vents make a world of difference when it comes to damp. And I think there's one under there somewhere-ish, which has been covered over or I've covered it over. Um, but yeah, so that's where I'm at at the moment. I am now turning my old bedroom into a workshop basically so yeah anyway that's nice and short and sweet and hopefully a bit more progress will be made next time Ta-da!